Hello, my name is Laura Petraco with Camera Behind the Curtain, and I am here at the Stained Glass Theater with Hans Weikart. That's me. Who is playing Black Stash in Footlighter's upcoming production of Peter and the Starcatcher. We are going to be getting to know Hans a little bit about the show and anything else we get ourselves into. So stick around because we are going center, center stage. stage. Hans, for those people out there who may not be familiar with the show, um, can you give them a short synopsis of the show? Yeah, absolutely. Clearly, as the title says, Peter and the Star Catcher, the show is all about me, Black Stash. <laughs> okay, actually, it's not really in the title, oh, but in the artwork, it is all about me. <laughs> that stash is me. So the show chronicles the life of Blackstash as he goes through and pirating through the seas and coming across the various individuals such as an orphan boy who eventually becomes Peter Pan. You kid. might have heard of him, I don't know. <laughs> there's a Molly, there's a whole other cast of characters, but really it's the character progression of the life of Blackstash, um, one of the greatest legendary pirates ever known to man. There you have it, folks. Um, so, Blackstash, yeah. um, how do you relate to your character? You know, Blackstash is a consummate performer. He's always on. He's yeah. always performing, whether it's for the pirates, for the orphans, for the, the lords and the ladies. Um, he's a showman. And, you know, ever since I was six years old, I was Papa Bear and Goldilocks and the Three Bears <laughs> uh, in the first grade. And I've been a performer ever since. I used to sit in front of the TV and mimic everything that Jim Carrey would do. And, you know, Ace Ventura and Dumb and Dumber and, you know, whatnot. So I, I relate to him in that sense, is in that he's always always on, I always feel like I'm on, no matter where I am. <laughs> you are the captain of a pirate ship. What is the name of your ship? The Rad. Why? Rad. It's one of the greatest 80s terms that I think should live on from decade to decade to decade. It was also one of my most favorite movies, cult classic movie, if you've ever seen Rad from the 80s. It's a BMX, like dirt bike kind of movie. Yeah. Fantastic. Lori McLaughlin in it before uh, Family, uh, what was that show? Uh, Full House. Full House, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Great, great flick. Anyways, back to my pirate ship, it would be the Rad. <laughs> I don't know any of those references that you just made, other than Full House, but I want to be a part of your pirate crew. <laughs> you can be a part of me nasty crew. <laughs> All right, Hans, I need you to go on a journey with me for a second. Um, they, the big directors in Hollywood, they are making a movie about your life. Of course. I need to know who you would want to play you in that movie. Um, and that, why. That's an easy one. Uh, Laura, it would definitely be Robert Downey Jr. Yes. Yeah, right? You know, I mean, the guy has his career progression over time, but particularly his Iron Man, Tony Stark portrayals. Yeah. I mean, he's got the perfect mix of like swagger and suave and intelligence. I mean, all things I clearly possess. <laughs> so he's the yes. perfect actor to play me. <laughs> Hans, it is time for the game. Are you ready? Oh, I'm ready. <laughs> Great. Um, the name of the game that we are playing today is Musical Charades. The way it works, um, we will have musicals that we will be acting out, like you do in charades, and the other person will be, will be guessing those mm -hmm. musicals. Um, the person who can get the most musicals correct in 30 seconds is the winner. What do I win? Um, See how I did that? I, I presumed that I was just going to win. I should have said... What does the winner get? You win the new car. And the fame and glory of winning charades here on Center Stage. Let's do it. <laughs> He's over I know. Job. He's Let's taking over. Get out of here, Hans. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Hans, whenever you're ready. Go. Oh, Sweeney Todd. Yes. Brain, hair, hair. 
circle of life. Lion King. Jump in the circle. Elevator. Uh, a carousel! <laughs> that was good. Rain, uh, we're singing in the rain! Yes! One, stop! <laughs> See, I Nailed it. told you those would be good. Nailed it. Your carousel Woo. is good. Yeah, yeah, right? <laughs> awesome. All right, here we go. Bye bye, Birdie. Yes! Bye bye, Birdie. <laughs> um, Phantom of the Opera. Yes. Good job. Um, I, oh, God, this was terrible. Um, <laughs> it's going to be great. We're going to skip that one for a hot second. Okay. Um, um, <laughs> Wicked. <laughs> 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 Hans, thank you so much for hanging out today. Thanks for having me, Laura. It was a blast. Um, tell the audience all the info about the show that they need to know. That's right. Come see me as Black Stash in Black Stash and the Star Catcher. Just nope, kidding. It's not. Peter and the Star Catcher. <laughs> playing at the Stained Glass Theater in Newport, Kentucky, November 29th through December 15th. For tickets, go to footlighters.org. See you at the theater. There you go. You guys do not want to miss this guy. He is going to be fantastic. I'm excited to see it, and you should come too. Um, Hans, thank you again for hanging out. Thank you all for watching, and we will see you soon on Camera Behind the Curtain.